Okay guys, in this video we're going to look at how to edit the main menu on your website. On this example website we'll see that we have new arrivals, babies, girls and boys. A lot of you will have home, about us, services, contact, etc. Let's look at how to edit that. So what we're going to do is we're going to hop over to our dashboard one more time. On the left hand side each person should have a tab that says menus. If we hover over this we're going to click menus again. Once we click on this, it's going to display a page which is going to show the menu settings for our website. Here we can see select a menu to edit. Some websites have different menus. A footer menu which is usually at the bottom of your website. Let's scroll down here. Or it could be here. It could be at the very bottom or it could be anywhere down the bottom. Or your main menu which is usually the menu at the top of your website. So if we want to edit the main menu, we can put it in there, hit select, the page will refresh and show us the main menu that we have on our website. Here we can see we have all our different tabs, new arrivals, babies, girls, boys, shipping returns and privacy policy. If we want to add a new one, we have our pages here. We can view all the pages on our website and we can add any of these to the menu by clicking the box beside them. So let's add the home page. And then we click the box beside it and hit add to menu. Once added to the menu it will naturally go to the top if it's a home. If it's a different page it will go to the bottom. And if we want to move that page, our newly added cart page anywhere, we can simply hold down on the mouse button and drag and drop it to wherever we wish. If we want cart to be a drop down of another menu item, so if we want to have a drop down, we can simply bring it under new arrivals for example and drag it out to the right a touch. If we then want to add babies as a drop down again under carts, we can drag it out. So you can drag them out as many times as you want and that will perform drop downs. If happy with this, we can hit save menu. Once we've saved our menu, we can go back to our website to see if our menu has updated. We can now see we have our new home button. We now have our new arrivals with our drop down. Oh, don't click on it. Our new arrivals with our drop down cars, and then our drop down babies, and our babies with our drop down girls. As you can see, we have new arrivals with our drop down car, drop down babies, and drop down girls. If we want to move this back to normal. We can simply just drag and drop them with our mouse and hit save. If we want to move a page off our menu, we can click on a page here, the little arrow, and click remove. And hit save. In this video, we just looked at how to add pages. So of course you'd have had to have added a page prior to adding it to your menu, which is in our other video, how to add a page to your website. This is how to add those pages to your main navigational menu. You may also add a blog post if you have any written, a custom link, so you might send it to any website that you wish. You put the link in here and the text and add to menu, a category from your website and hit save. 